YouTube. Some of you told me if I recorded from the side that I might be able to get a full screen for you. I'm working on it. But this is my dollar store seed haul. And I do have some that I got last year. I'm sure they will all come in the store pretty soon. But I got thyme, peas, leeks, mustards, beets, um, lettuce, radish, all kind parsnips, all kinds of herbs there. And then these bulbs come from the 99 cent store. This is garlic and these are shallots. I purchased that from the grocery section of the store. I'm going to plant them and hope that I get some beautiful A-L-L-I-U-M, which is the botanical name for garlic, alum, alum, uh, alliums, I think is how you pronounce it. But they give beautiful global flowers, which are edible. The leaves are edible. Garlic and onion, they're just beautiful plants. You will see me doing that in a minute. Okay, I'm showing you I have planted my peas. This is my planter here. It is companion gardening. This is my roses. I have it in an old gumbo tub here. And I have planted these one inch apart. And it took a whole packet in this one planter. These are the pea seeds. So they're, no, they're two inches apart. I'm going to put another packet in here so that I have them one inch apart. And um, then I will go. Okay, so I am all finished. I just scattered the peas on top of the soil. Let me zoom in so you can see that. There are the peas. They're just scattered on top of the soil. They are actually more like a half inch apart. You zoom out, maybe that'll help you to see they are more like a half inch apart. I am not going to cover them. I am going to let them grow like that. There's peas everywhere and I will just eat the pea shoots they are so sexy in your food dishes and then I got a shallot here planted and a garlic bulb there so that would be for the summer